All right. I just, <laughs> I just wanted to take a brief moment to welcome everyone to the very first Ignite Winnipeg talk. We have a great lineup of speakers to come this evening, and I will introduce them all as they come up to speak. As you have probably heard, the Ignite series consists of short five-minute talks, um, like the one that I'm attempting to deliver, with slides automatically advancing every 15 seconds. This may lead to chaos, but that's okay. We thrive on chaos and uncertainty here at 245 McDermott. <laughs> if after tonight's presentations you think you'd like to speak at a future Ignite event or would like to nominate someone else to speak, please let me know. We are always looking for a variety of speakers across the creative and cultural sectors. The presentations will be filmed tonight and uploaded to YouTube, so if you'd like to share one of the talks, they'll be available on the 245 McDermott YouTube page sometime in the next week or two. For those who don't know me, I'm Callie Ramsey. My job is basically to animate this space. I manage the co-working space on the third floor, and I manage the classroom rentals here. I also get to plan fun events to bring Winnipeg's creative community together, like tonight's Ignite. And sometimes I put birds on things. I started some new streams of programming, like our partnership with Ascentworks. They are a makerspace in Adelaide that houses 3D printers, laser etchers, and other cool machines. We have been offering a series of six workshops together, and the next is on the history of 3D printing, which will be next Tuesday. I've also started organizing First Friday events, which started in December. We have opened up this space that we're in right now um, to musicians, to poets, to photographers, fashion designers, quilters, and artists and creatives in many other disciplines. And now for a little bit of a background of who we are. ACI Manitoba is the Arts and Cultural Industries Association of Manitoba, and we provide professional development to artists and cultural workers. We operate a youth mentorship program, an indigenous art program, and promote collaboration and interaction across all creative disciplines. We are offering a series of marketing workshops presented by change makers over the next few weeks, covering topics such as brand strategy and development, strategic online development, and plan implementation. Our AscentWorks series of workshops covers the topics of 3D printing, a marketing overview, an overview of laser cutters and CNC router, and every artist's absolute favorite topic ever, tax and financial management. <laughs> um, we are offering a workshop for new and recent grads of arts programs called Creative Entrepreneurship, um, putting your arts degree to work. We are also offering workshops for artists working with community and for artists wanting to become educators. Among many, many other workshops, we have far too many streams of programming scheduled for the next few months um, to get into detail about all of them. In 2013, we opened up a co-working space here at 245 McDermott on the third floor, which provides independent creative entrepreneurs and organizations with contemporary, affordable, shared workspace. I won't talk too much more about it as, spoiler alert, one of our other presenters will be getting into more detail about that. Um, and although we do keep busy and work hard at, here at ACI Manitoba, we also like to take some time for some fun. We recently competed, well, showed up. I can't say we were very competitive at the Manitoba Music Bonds Field a few weeks ago. Um, I'd like to extend a big thank you to Danelle Cloutier for filming this event tonight. She has been a part of ACI for many years, longer than I have even. She started in our youth mentorship program, she's worked as a summer intern, and now she is helping us as part of her CRECOM program at Red River College. I also want to send out a big thank you to all the presenters who gave up their cold Thursday evenings to be here. Thanks to all the ACI staff who helped pull this together, and thanks to everyone who showed up to see these crazy talks. I know we have some prolific tweeters in the audience tonight, so feel free to tweet away. If you want to use the hashtag IgniteWinnipeg, you can see what other people have to say about the event and connect with some of the others in the audience. Again, if you have any questions, comments, or want to get involved with what we're doing here at 245 McDermott, you can connect with me in any of these various channels. There's my email, the 245 Twitter, and our blog. Um, I'm looking forward to a great evening, and thanks so much for being here.